Here, this is a cowboy's loss. Put this on. Stop! <laughs> everybody welcome to another vlog it is January 16th 2017 early I'm up early in the morning because I got my entire family here we're heading out for a little Aliante breakfast action to start the day so when you have a chance to uh, have uh, dinner with your family entire family it's best to do that whenever you, the, ch the chance you get because you know our kids are growing up really, really fast and they might be out of the house you know before you know it so you know, you gotta take, you gotta take advantage of these moments. No coupons for you either. Never give me. Yeah, that's probably because the switch, they're switching over to be connected. So. It is. Yeah. Ooh. That's new. Ready to get some food? Yes. Breakfast food, tear it up. Yeah, breakfast is a lot slower here than during uh, seafood night. So my daughter put butter on pancakes instead of syrup, <laughs> right? Oh, you forgot? Oh, here. It's like syrup. Oh, uh, right there, Anna, right here. See that syrup right there, right? That is syrup. Yeah. Gotta have my banana. So when they first opened this buffet, like in 2011, this is a great buffet. They have all kinds of stuff here, like blocks, they had sushi, they had shrimp. Since then, actually since they, they uh, when Aliante bought, when uh, the stations bought them out, then they sold them. This buffet has gone to crap. There is like nothing really here. It's like basic, basic stuff here. So, but you know, feeds family of five. So, if you guys ever come to Vegas, I highly not coming to Aliante for the buffet. Well, I'd be remiss if I didn't mention uh, Martin Luther King Day. Today is MLK Day. And in these times, the, um, the landscape of today's world, uh, some of the words and the sayings from, Mr. Doctor, from Dr. Martin Luther King is really prevalent now. You know, people are really like, really insensitive and like, they, they are like, they snap to things too quickly. They snap to judgment too quickly. People are too sensitive now these days. You know, you can't say anything. Without, every, without 9 million people being mad at you, no matter what you say. And you know, Dr. King was a man who preached tolerance, a man who, pe who preached respect, and a man who preached patience. And that last word is what we need to be as a, as a society now, is patience. Because the next four years is gonna be interesting with, with our new president. I'm not sure how it's gonna go, not sure what direction this, this country's going, but no matter what happens the next four years, just everybody be patient. Don't go off on a tangent so quick when you don't like something because this world is a marathon, not a sprint. On this day, Martin Luther King's birthday, remember his words that practice tolerance. Practice patience. So I've been sitting here on top of the garage here at work for about five minutes now because I am freaking tired. All of a sudden, I don't know what happened. All of a sudden, I am tired. I think it's a combination of sleeping late last night. I didn't go to bed until 12.30. Then eating that big breakfast this morning has made me incredibly drowsy. I think I've yawned maybe 15 times driving to work. Oh my God, hope I can make it through the day. I am dead tired. I feel like taking a nap like right now, but I'm just starting off my work day. Wow. 
Time's about 11. I should take a quick five minute nap. But I'm afraid if I fall asleep, I may not wake up till like one, two o'clock. So, this is Grim and Barrett. I really don't want any caffeine either. I'm trying to cut down the caffeine. So, this might be a tough day here. So, I just got off work here. I'm driving off. Got this little dull headache going. I think I get I get these headaches sometimes, especially right now when I'm freaking hungry. But I think part of it, part of the deal is get the heater on real quick. I think part of it is that uh I need a mid like a mid snack, which I really don't do as often as I should. Sometimes I'll buy like a bunch of granola bars from the store and I'll take one to work. And I'll eat it like during the day. You know, sometimes to get that sugar level up or whatever. I haven't done it. So, my last thing I ate was like on, I think, 11.30. I haven't eaten anything since. I need, a, I need to um, get a snack or something to eat between like 2 and 3. Especially during the times where we're busy and I can't get out of the room. Like Even Altoid. Sometimes I have like an Altoid and I'll get me through till, till my break. So that's the thing, that's the reason why I got a little bit of a headache right now. Because I drink a lot of water during the day. I drink a lot of water. So I don't think it's that. But, like, I don't know. Sometimes I get flustered or something. But I don't have enough sugar. But, oh well. So right now, because right now I'm, like, really tired. You know, like, you know, this afternoon I came to work, I was tired. And, you know, being around the casino, it's tiring. So, I don't know. I don't know what it is. You know what could be? Now, now that I'm thinking about it, I think it might be the smoke. You know, I've been in the industry for like 12, in the casino industry for like 12 years, and the smoke doesn't really bother me. I don't know why it doesn't bother me, but today it just seemed, I don't know, it's bothering me more than it usually is, than it usually does. So let me just enjoy this 30 minute ride back home. Wife is cooking some salmon and some something she called cauliflower rice. So I'm gonna tear that up and then I gotta watch wrestling and I gotta pack some stuff I sold on eBay today. So it's gonna be another long night. Another long night for your old friend Ronnie Bizzle. So here's what I was telling you guys about the salmon, the cauliflower rice, and the green beans. Hopefully eating this will get this headache away from me. And I get some energy because I got a lot to do tonight before I go the bed so let me eat my dinner then we go pack the stuff on ebay and then i gotta um, what else i gotta do watch wrestling I gotta watch wrestling today is monday i gotta watch wrestling so the stuff is packed for ebay now i'm watching wrestling here monday night raw I gotta watch wrestling so i'm gonna end the vlog here so i can relax the rest of the night so if you like my video, please comment, like, and subscribe. Please share with your friends. Follow me on Twitter. Follow me on Instagram. I'll talk to you tomorrow. Thanks for watching.